Hey, it's Wicked Pixel, and in this video, I have a showcase of three functional items plus this lovely house that you'll be able to download. I'll have links to everything in the description, but we have functional horses, functional bungee jumping, and functional cars. Now, the car in particular. Uh, it's the best functional car that we have. The only thing is that you have to drive on the sidewalk most of the time. But um, I'll be driving it around in the forest area or the wooded areas of Windenburg. Now, another thing about the car mod is that it is not compatible with all the other functional vehicle so if you've got the ATV wheelchairs and scooters and all those type of things or even these horses they will not um, they the animation will be a little uh, won't work so you have to use either or so right now I have in the horses and then I'll switch it out at the end of the video so these horses they're they're fully functional the only thing with them is they do kind of like stutter or stutter step I'll show you in a minute but uh, this is a ranch it's an older build it's been available for a long time for a few years now but um, it's uh, really really good it comes with uh, these decorative horses and decorative animals and stuff I took most of them off except for the horses but uh, I think you'd like this if you want it it comes with all the CC and uh, if you don't have all the packs that's fine but the um, CC is pretty good. It comes comes with all that. I love the the kitchen and everything. So it's a very rustic rustic build. So yeah, uh, really really nice. So that'll be in the description. So let's get started riding with these horses. So all you have to do is just just like the bike. It overrides the bike. So I will ride bike. Let me go ahead and, and ride bike, and then I'll have him go because otherwise he'll ride through the house. Let's ride through here, bike here. Let's see how that. Um, like I say, it looks weird, but it it's the you know it's the best that we have. It's really slow, but um, you know it's not too bad. It's not too bad. At night, it has the, uh, let's go ahead and do ride around, ride bike around. At night, it has the um, headlights and the brake lights. <laughs> so your horse have be lit up a little bit. Well, that was pretty cool. Let's speed it up. And I'm also going to show you how to put items, you know, almost anywhere with the tool mod. That'll be in the description as well. So you can bungee jump off of a cliff. All right, here we go. We're going to do some bungee jumping. All right, he will vampire up <laughs> and dive. Hold on, hold on. Let's look at this as close as possible. Look at the bravery. <laughs> All right, let's look at him. It, it, I have to, I'll have to zoom out because it's so high up. Or you know what? I can do it that way, I guess. Oh my goodness. And do it that way. Well, this is a mess. There you go. There, right into the, right into the bricks or the rock and break your arm. It looks like he broke his arm, <laughs> but he's okay. So I'm going to show you how to put these anywhere or anything for that matter um, off your off your lot. Nope, don't ride anything. Don't ride. Uh, where is he? Oh, he's getting on it anyway. This thing kickstand your horse. <laughs> put him in your pocket. All right, all right. So. If you have the tool mod, um, I had the hardest time trying to figure out how to work because there weren't like any really good tutorials on it and it was complicated. But uh, Iron Seagull's tutorial showed me how to do it. Extremely simple when you're just moving things off of here to where you normally wouldn't be able to put something. So what you would do, let's say that, um, let's say you wanted to put this, um, 
here which you normally wouldn't be able to cross this line with that what you would do is just uh, hold down your shift key on your keyboard and then click on the item you want to move go to the tool mod toggle active o object and then hold down shift again and click where you want the item to go tool options and then move object here and then click it again and then toggle active object so there now you've got that's out of the way and we can go in there for one and um, uh, you can put things off your anywhere except for where it goes like red you can't put anything there so that's that's the only limitation but at least you can like off your 64 by 64 which I think is kinda bigger than that but you can put it you know anywhere around and make your world look even uh, fuller okay so next let's look at the cars and well let me show you how where I let's put the bungee thing here it's uh, really quick and I'll just put it right here can't put it right there move object there click it again tool toggle active object there we go real simple okay so I'm going to add the cars and then we'll drive around in that okay I switched out the horses so they are gone and I'm going to place down the car I think I'll place the car out here and um, I, it will be right here when you download it it will actually be this bike or one of the bikes and you won't see a car but when you place it it will be a car so that comes in different colors um, white blue whatever red there's a red one I believe yeah oh no nope, that came out green and they, they sometimes they they kind of yeah they kind of float or whatever you won't see the driver but uh, it's all, it's all good um, what I like about it is <laughs> it has uh, stuff in the in the in, in in the car actually see they kind of pop up or whatever you know hey what what can you do so he's still here so let's have him right around wait right around right around and have him right around too and we'll follow him uh, bike around and get rid of these notifications okay let's see where he is and that's the animation to get into the car hold on alright I took off the headline effects and you'll hear the sound of the car motor etc so it um, like I say if you're um, in like Newcrest or Willow Creek or something like that you'll be driving up and down the sidewalk so um, in Del Sol Valley you can drive like in the alley which is a little bit more realistic let's speed it up they drive slow too and there's our floating other floating car it levels up your fitness pretty good pretty fast alright look at us driving into the ground <laughs> come on catch up catch up oh oh <laughs> <laughs> the first car wreck in the sims 4 <laughs> all right that's gonna do it for this video i hope you enjoyed it if you did give it a thumbs up subscribe and i'll see you in the next video take care